Howdy partner. So you want to learn how to fix a shower door latch? Well, you're in luck. We're going to show you today. Today, we're going to walk you through how to replace one of these shower door latches. If your door is no longer staying closed, and it's doing one of this, and this needs to be replaced, and we're going to walk you through it. So stay tuned and check it out. So this shower door catch here, it's pretty simple. It's got a little piece of plastic that's supposed to be spring-loaded that pops out right here. So when the door closes, it should hit that piece of plastic and it should catch it. The problem is our spring is worn out, so this doesn't come out very well anymore. So it's not catching, as you can see. So we're going to try to get this replaced so it'll start catching again. We ordered this replacement catch off Amazon for... I think it was about $2. And as you can see, there's a spring in here, and this is the part that gets pushed in and holds the door. So let's see if that one is gonna fit where the other one was. As you can see, they're the same size, so the screw hole should line up. We'll go ahead and get that replaced. You can see this one, the tab sticks out much further, so it'll catch that door. So we'll unscrew and take off the old one once we get this off. We'll have to clean it, up, clean it up a little bit. You can reuse these screws or you can use the new ones that came with it if they're the same size. Hopefully we don't have to do new screw holes. And you can see this one, the spring is completely gone. It doesn't hold at all and that's why the latch isn't working. So we'll get that replaced. So we've cleaned it up a little bit and we've checked and the holes should line up just right if you see from in front of it, it should be right sticking out. Yep, so that's what we're looking for. So now we're just gonna install these two screws. And then we'll check to see how it does. These are the new screws, but luckily they're compatible. And this is also an adjustable, you see how it's open-ended. So depending on where you needed your uh, spring to stick out to, you could do it they're either further in this way or further out that way. Okay, so we got this all installed. We were able to use the same two holes, but if you needed to, you could drill new ones and readjust it. This is sticking out a proper amount, and when we close the door, it catches. Very nice. Very good. All fixed. Well, we are all fixed, and it's nice, and the door is staying closed. Thanks for tuning in to Mr. Greg's How To. Be sure to like, comment, and most importantly, please subscribe. Really appreciate you taking a second to go ahead and hit the subscribe button. That keeps this channel going. Again, if you have any questions or comments or you want to see any other videos, please put them in the comment box. And remember, with all these projects, if I can do it, you can too. Thanks for watching.